This map represents unemployment in the United States. Dark colors represent the highest levels of unemployment. During the 1990s Bill Clinton, left to his own devices, would have moved the United States in much the same hard left direction as the Obama administration. Luckily, gridlock prevented the same centralization we see in the Obama administration. This relative weakness meant little political instability and didn't fuel recessions. You can see that downturns were localized and resolved quickly. All was not well though. The Bush administration adopted Clinton's leftist agenda in the 2000s. This agenda coupled with a war that cost considerably more than projected led to reckless monetary expansion. These policies would lead to a short sharp recession if market forces were allowed to reallocate misdirected capital, however Bush refused to veto interventionist laws passed by Congress. Obama's radical left policies and zest for nationalization created political instability, an externality which deepened the 2009 depression. The deepness, sharpness, and volatility of the Obama depression is entirely the result of Obama's war on business and productive sectors of the economy. History shows there will be no recovery until Obama's anti-business agenda is stopped in its tracks.